Anyway, from roasting marshmallows round the campfire to learning basic survival techniques, becoming a, yes, scout has always proved a popular pastime for many youngsters. But far from this organisation dying out, it seems these days it's as popular as ever. In the last year, more young people joined the scouts in Nottinghamshire than ever before. Tom Brown went along to one new group in Skegby to find out why. After a six-year absence, scouting in Skegby is back. More than 40 beavers, cubs and scouts have signed up here, just some of the more than 700 that joined across Nottinghamshire in the past 12 months. But why is this century-old organisation still so appealing today? There's lots of different activities to do and it's better than just sitting at home. Yeah, you get to meet new friends uh, and new people. The website looked really fun and I just thought it would be really fun to come and try it out. They learn great things, um, they learn interaction with other children as well as, well as adults, um, but they get new experiences that they wouldn't normally get within their everyday life. Old lessons with a modern twist have helped the Scouts stay relevant to today's young people, but it takes more than just new technology to get more children sworn in as Scouts. I think we've seen such a significant rise this year um, because we've really focused on areas that, that need scouting um, and that would benefit from having scouting. Um, so areas like this here in Skegby, uh, I think that our Chief Scout Bear Grills, when he came to Nottinghamshire, was really impressed with what was happening. Loads of young people got to meet him uh, and he really is an inspirational guy, so to have him as our figurehead I think has helped us as well. But Nottinghamshire isn't alone in seeing a scouting surge. Across the East Midlands, more than a thousand wannabe scouts remain on the waiting list. This is a rise in popularity that perhaps isn't over yet. Tom Brown, East Midlands Today, in Skegby.